Welcome to the beautiful city of Montreal, home to the founding policy convention of the Conservative Party of Canada. Now, it's all happening in that rainbow-colored building behind me, and it is my job here today to make a Conservative convention remotely interesting. And I'm going to use every weapon in my arsenal, including treachery, deceit, and yes, April wine. Cue the cowbell. <laughs> Peter McKay, how's the convention going? Extremely well. Everyone's oh. very happy. Everyone is uh, focused. Now you and Stephen, you're having a couple of, you're having some problems. Are you kind of like a married couple that are staying together for the kids? Is, is, it, <laughs> is, that, is that what it's like at this point? Is the constant talk about you and your girlfriend just nauseating you, or do you like that? People have been very respectful and, and uh, you know, and very supportive. You were, you were very kind, very generous to uh, to Belinda when she too was too generous, there. really. Yeah, and I'm getting soft. Getting soft. Yeah. Now they're debating a very important motion. Someone stood up and suggested that they add the word progressive back to the name Conservative Party. So they're now going to vote on whether or not to cut off that man's hands. <laughs> Golf with his hands. Are you having a good time? Having a ball. Are you going to all the parties? I've been to most of them, yes. Yeah, did you go to Belinda's big dust up? I... Apparently she spent 50 grand. I, I was kicked out. Why were you thrown out? Well, there's a thing called age, I guess. Oh, you're under age. I am. You were looking for a few drinks. Oh, well, you know, I, I was just there for a good time. Right. Everything will be all right. Come on, come on, love me tonight. And I'll be yours till the sun comes up. All the white people, please raise your hands. Talk to me about this youth wing issue. Oh, it's very important. We need we need young people in the party. So some people pro youth wing, some people against youth wing. Yes. Some people walking around with buttons with youth with the uh, slash. Yes, through. and then some of them, you know, we got the pro youth wing buttons too. Yes to a youth wing. No youth wing. Yes to a youth wing. So it's official. The Conservative Party will have no youth wing. And this is the chair of the working session, so you were the guy up there during that whole youth debate. I was. Ziggy zaggy, ziggy zaggy, oink, oink, oink. Does that happen a lot? Um, only when it's close. Ziggy, zaggy, ziggy, zaggy. Mm -hmm. Did you understand that? No, you didn't. So, okay. I did, I followed it. Okay, good. Okay. And while there's no doubt about it that 99% of the issues being discussed here are incredibly boring, one question remains, is this a party that's obsessed with sex? Do they even have sex? I'm here to find out. When was the last time you did it? Uh, 14. When you were 14? Yeah. I and then that was it? Yeah. Let's see, 16? Si when you were 16? When I was 16, yeah. That was it? Yeah. So you just tried it once and then? That's right, got caught. You're, a, you're an abstainer. I'm an abstainer. So you're just an abstainer now? I am an abstainer now, yes. It yeah. wasn't worth the hassle. When was the last time? Well, probably about the same time Bill Clinton did. Really? Yes. You never ever think of uh, maybe trying it? No. Nope. Yeah, when was the last time you did it? About 10 minutes ago. <laughs> I had an opportunity when I was seven or eight, and I decided then no. Oh, I guess. Well, that was probably wise. Never did it. Nope. That's a little weird, isn't it? Yeah, I am. Did you ever? Once. Well, a few times when I was 16. Sorry, Mom. Damn it. What about people saying that the party's obsessed with uh, sex? Now, suddenly, they're, they're playing music in the room, so we better go in. I don't know what's going on, but I think there might be a heck of a lot of white people dancing. Look, they're all up out there on the stage. Look at that. It's like the special ed classes up there. This party knows how to party. They don't really. The next Prime Minister of Canada, Stephen Harper. I've been in and around this business for a surprisingly long time. I'm starting to have the gray hairs to show it. Boy, the energy just got sucked out of the room then, didn't it? Come on, come 
other notes. Everything will be all right. Come on, come on, love me tonight. And I'll be yours till the sun goes up. I hope this gets me a date. I don't want to go for a ride. I've never been this nervous before in my life. 